Thank you, Mike and Hamish. Our competitors are taking this very seriously. I have here with me Jasper, who looks really unassuming, and I saw how you went through the course effortlessly. So what is your strategy today? Uh, I think I'll just do my best and hope for the best. So I'll try my best to be a ninja warrior. Then um, if I fail, at least I know where I stand in the, like, among the elites. Uh. Jasper was the third fastest guy for stage one. He made it through with a time of one minute and 15 seconds. And he's back now for, well, he's cut his hair. He cut his hair. He did. Wait, and he didn't dye it. I know. So, so he's got his he's got his real color hair, and uh, well, this guy's flying up the road. Absolutely. Can he beat 25 seconds? You can see his family there in that shot as well. They're looking unbelievable. Wow. <laughs> How fast he's going up the rope. I'm upset that he doesn't look like Justin Bieber anymore. Yeah. Because I'd love to see Justin Bieber flying up this rope like that. <laughs> he's almost there. Oh, he could beat 25 seconds. Where are we at? Come on, hit that buzzer. Come on, Justin. <laughs> All right, here's the replay, and he's going up that rope really fast. Yeah, but unfortunately, he is one second off our fastest time. Congratulations, Jasper. You made it to the top, but do you know what's your time? Uh, no. How fast do you think you did it? Maybe about 30 or something. Well, the good news is it's 26 seconds. The bad news is our fastest timing is 25 seconds. Yeah. Well, what was going on through your mind when you were doing the climb? Before the climb, there's a lot of things in my mind. Uh, I thought I would be using my legs, but then uh, I managed to use my arms all the way up. So I think that's, that, that made my timing a bit faster.